What's up guys, it's Shadaktor MPX and we're back with another episode of Windcraft. Today we're going to be continuing our quests, but this time in the town of Maltic. So I decided I'd just uh, make my way here off camera because it was already quite the distance away. So I'm already here at our first mission, our mango is in the background, so let's get started, shall we? Alright, so while we're here, I'm going to also just open up this, this chest, grab some emeralds while we're here. Ooh, another guy. <laughs> All right, let's Hi. talk to him. My name is Amango. I'm a resident of the Maltic village on top of the hill. As you may know, our people came to your land years ago, and this is the ship they used. They brought lots of luxurious goods with them. Most of them got lost in the wreck. But recently, a small hole has opened in the shipwreck here. It is believed that fortune is hidden within it. Unfortunately, nobody has been able to explore it. It is too deep. No creature can survive underwater that long. However, my old friend Sayer is a fisherman, and I know that he has a very special helmet. If you convince him to give you this helmet and find the treasure, I'll give you a part of it. Sayer is out on his boat, but the cave next to me is a quick way over to where he does his fishing. Be careful on the way, though. When you finally have the helmet, explore the ship, and bring me back four ancient treasure. Good luck! Okay. The boat next to you. Okay. Right over here. Okay. Now it's just to go to over here. Okay. Well. Yeah. Oh, that's simple enough. All right. Here we are. Why are you looking at me like that? Is it because I'm small, eh? I'll have you know that I caught fish that were twice your size. <laughs> or, well, I used to be able to. Nothing's biting recently. Oh, wait a sec. Why'd you hop on my boat anyway, stranger? <laughs> yes, I still have that old breathing helmet. Uh, you want it? You have to do a little something for me first. I'm sure you help me, but the fish just aren't biting around here anymore. I need to make a living somehow. Uh, there's some fish. It's a bit dangerous. I I'll tell you what, I'll give you my fishing rod, and you can go catch me, say, ten and it'll be all yours after that. Alright, I have to go fishing. I already have one of these. I don't need that. Yoink. And go over there. <laughs> okay, so I got a few gudgeon mm, meat here. I'll just try and get the normal one first. There you go, level it up again. Welcome back. Any luck with the fish? Great, and I'll thank you kindly. Here's your helmet. Have fun with that. Nice, alright, so we got the helmet. Item, breathing helmet. Alright, so we'll just pop that on and we've got healing, I assume. Pop that there. Well, we've got a dagger. We don't need it, but, you know. Just in case. Alright, I had to come back with four, and I just got 15 so i have a feeling that is enough <laughs> okay I... you got it you found the treasure as promised here's your part of the loot nice all right i don't need that anymore <laughs> yeah i don't want that okay so we got Unidentified treasure boots. Ooh, they're definitely better in terms of health. Okay, so we just have to make our way to, um, I guess, the city back to Deathless. But before we do that, we'll oh, we'll go through this. 
Uh, let's pop some points towards our agility. And, ooh, we got one of these now. So, ooh, what to do, what to do, what to do. Well, makes sense that we go for air. Since we've got an air thing. I assume I can play around with this once I've... Um, 15% air damage. Cool. I like it. Yeah, I assume I can have a play around with that by resetting it or something like that. That's back at that list. Okay, so let's do Multics well. There we go. Just right here. We'll head on to there. This is Multic. Tool Merchant. What is the Tool Merchant so Is it just like normal tools? Yeah, just normal tools. Ooh. Oh, identifier. Oh, cool. We can use him. Let's use you for this, for this, for this, and that's it. All right. So, Midnight Bell. This is a normal tag. Let's just put it here so I can look at it better. I think this is better. Ours obviously has the water because we have the powder slot, but I think this is going to be us changing our. Ooh. But from there, let's uh, talk to. What's his name? Ryan End. All right. Please help us. We called for a Ragni guard days ago, but humans tend to forget this little village. <laughs> Last week. An evil witch found refuge in our old well. Normally this wouldn't be a problem, but she's lured my child into the well. My only child. He was born in Wynn. That makes him a Wynn citizen. Please do something. I know Maltic isn't of importance to you humans, being a villager settlement, but my son! Alright, no problem. Oh, I have to go in the well. I just jump down. We. Uh. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Where am I going? Rat. Get out of here, rat. Get. Get out of here. I guess just uh, follow around. Nothing there. Investigate the old Maltic well. Bring one which is empty bottle. Okay. We gotta... Gotta bring an empty bottle. Ooh. Okay, let's follow these. You seem to be the way. Help me! Someone! Oh. The witch is being mean! <laughs> <laughs> I wondered when they send the famous Ragni guards. You'll never get me! <laughs> I was like a kid. I can still park all that. Parkour. 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 Alright, there we go. <laughs> Easy. I don't know yeah. why they call me a witch. Magic is everywhere, you know. This one's father made fun of my looks. So I'll turn his son into a grok. Treat me like a witch. Hmm. I'll act like one, darn it. You will have to pass through my dastardly magical defenses to find me. Oh, I thought he was going to start doing the rhymes. Okay, so... Go through the doors. Go through the middle. Oh, drat. I never could get that spell right. Well, now you'll have to guess the way. Um, you fool, turn back now for a... For if you choose the wrong door, you'll be sent to a beast. A beast most foul. The, um, the beast what eats Ragni guards for brunch. Totally. I'm not convinced. Oh, uh, let's just keep going right, straight ahead. We'll get there eventually. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I didn't think that for you. You know, 
I'm not really all that good at magic. I just like wearing pointy hats and have warts. <laughs> Maybe if the people of this village weren't so mean to me, I wouldn't have been forced to live here. Okay. I know it's a crime, but his father and the rest of the villagers here hunt me like I'm a rabid dog. Okay. If I wasn't really going to turn this boy into a crook, I doubt I could even make him go one feather. I mean, watch. Uh, what's happening to me? Oh, my gosh. It worked? It worked. I did a spell for once in my miserable life. Wait, that's not good at all. You're gonna... No! You won't take me out of here alive. Well... Is he just holding a sword? <laughs> well then. <laughs> Hi, child. <laughs> Thank you for saving me from the witch. She was nice at first and made me cookies. But I want to go home now. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that witch was all too much of a witch, really. <laughs> I got your what? You got your bottle. Oh, my son. What happened down there? Huh? Not a witch, you say? You don't want to know. Preposterous. She wore a hat and had warts. I guess it's too <laughs> late now. Thank you so much for your help. Please, take this. I'm sure it'll help you someday. Well, thank you. What, what did he give me? I'm not actually sure he gave me anything. Unless it was emeralds and it just went straight to my... It was probably emeralds. Alright. So... Guess the next one is part of the storyline. Back in Debtless. We have a few in Debtless by the looks of it. Yeah, the next four are in Debtless. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll pop that on. Elemental exercise. And... Well, let's... Use this. Yoink. That's way easier to do. Now we're back in Deadless. Uh, I'll grab one of those scrolls again. From wherever the scroll is. Is it over here? Yeah, it's over here. I just couldn't see that bit yet. I hadn't rendered in. Alright, so we've got that. Pop that. Right back there. And I'll... Oh, yeah, I'll deal with the stuff that's in my inventory. So we'll deal with that. Uh, we'll go to... Mr. Blacksmith over here. Hello, Mr. Blacksmith. I'll sell you that. That. I'm not even sure if I can. Nope, I can't. Can I sell you that? Nice. I can't sell that, but I probably can just put it in my ender chest. It might be something. Let's take a check out our trades. Yeah, they're going. Have they been sold yet? No. No, I haven't seen. Click to view. Nope, haven't been sold yet, so they're still there. Uh, we'll. Put this stuff into the ender chest. I'll take out those stacks of emeralds actually as well. Put that there. And turn them into emerald blocks. And oh, not what I want to go into. There we go. <laughs> pop that there. Uh, we'll also pop this. Uh, I guess we'll pop quest items and stuff just here. Then so we can't get rid of them. And da, 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 da. I'll put the gudgeon. Oh, where did I put the paper stuff? Ah, uh, here. I'll put the gudgeon meat, the fish meat there. There we go. Oh, yeah, that's the other emerald pouch. There we go. I think that's all for all dealing with my inventory. Yep, yep. Got all this stuff. Nice. All right. So. I think that's all for now. So in the next episode, uh, we'll be taking on a whole bunch of quests that are in um, that list here. Uh, but for now, that's all from me. So we've taken on all the multi-quests there. 
uh, was quite interesting to see. Uh, but yeah, we've done that. Uh, I've got a new wand, which is technically the same as the other one, just slightly better stats. But yeah, so be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.